What's up guys, it's Dwayne from mountainbuck.com where we go from backyard to backwoods. And guys, I am super pumped because today we're going to make an amazing, a simply awesome hunting blind out of this big water tank I got right here. And guys, it might not look that big with me standing right here and that back there. Check out the size of this thing real quick. Look at this. That thing is massive. Some of the specs on it. It's probably about six and a half feet tall, over five foot in diameter. The thing is massive. It's about a thousand gallon tank. Um, I got it from this really nice guy for like $200. And it's gonna be a simple, super simple hunting blind build. Probably the easiest hunting blind build I've ever done. You got everything you need right here. It's totally plastic. You cut out your door, you cut out your windows. And guys, you can set this up exactly how you want. You don't have to worry about buying a preset plastic hunting blind with narrow slat windows for your compound bow and wide windows for your crossbow. You set it up however you want. Also, a quick note, do you know how much you pay for a hunting blind like this, not customized to your exact specifications? A hunting blind at Dick's or Cabela's or whatever of this quality, plastic, you're up at like at least $600 minimum. So this thing was 200 bucks. I'm not gonna spend a whole heck of a lot on the other stuff that goes in, into this thing. So 200 plus, $250, something along those lines. Way better than six, seven, eight hundred dollars am I right? Also, around the back, there are some valves that pipe out. So you guessed it, we're gonna put a urinal inside this thing and pipe that into the ground for those extra long days in the, in the blind. You know what I'm saying, guys? This is a super easy build. I'm so pumped for it. It's gonna be awesome. Hook me up, hit subscribe guys, hit like, comment below, all that good stuff. And uh, let's get started on this super awesome water tank hunting blind. I can't wait. Check out the inside, guys. It doesn't look super huge. But look, at, I'm standing in here. We got plenty of room. Uh, right down here, we're gonna put our, our little urinal port. It's gonna let that flow right to the outside for those extra long days in the stand, you know what I'm saying? Hey, you don't wanna step out of your deer blind, walk into the woods, take a quick pee, and have the deer bust you, right? Stay in your spot, be quiet, keep the scent down, pipe it into the ground, and they won't be any the wiser. You know what I'm saying? Smart.
Here it is, it is all wrapped up. It is our awesome water tank, tank of a blind. I mean, this thing is solid. Guys, check out the size of this plastic here. This is like really thick, durable material. This thing is going to last a really, really long time, forever, probably. I mean, I've made some IBC totes, you can check those videos out, but this thing, like, you really have a hard time even bending this stuff. This is super solid. It's gonna hold up really well to all kinds of conditions. Check this thing out, though. You've got the sliding plexiglass acrylic uh, window in the door here. The flip-up windows look awesome and work really well. You have the drip caps over each window, every single window, and the door, of course. Inside, of course, you have plenty of room. You got tons of room in this thing. You could probably fit two people in here if you wanted to. You also have that urinal. All I got to do to finish that thing off is add a little jug on there or something like that and then pipe it down to the ground. So I'm super pumped about this water blind stand, guys. It's going to be awesome. All I need to do really is just build a platform. I'll probably build like a 12 foot platform, put this thing up on top of it and then pipe down the uh, the urinal system down into the ground below. So once we get that set up, I'll probably do another video on that. But it all came together really nicely. Awesome blind, about $250 total. And I love it, I'm pretty excited about it. I can't wait to get it up in the woods and set it up uh, once I build that other platform. So as always, the links to the items we talked about are in the description below. I'm gonna put everything we talked about in, in the description below for you guys. Hook me up and hit subscribe, guys. Thank you so much for hanging out and we'll see you on the next one.